it's kind of like a little barrier here. I cross this cross guard and when I'm headed home, everything kind of just falls behind me and I get ready for uh, what's ahead of me when I hit the door at home. Hey Reed! Hey Darlin! Careful! Well, you'll see uh, Jill, my wife, and uh, my girls, Kate and Anna Claire, are nine and eight. Uh, Reed and Gray and Bennett. Reed is five, Gray is three, and Bennett's about 20 months old. And if they are themselves, you'll see pure and total chaos. You know, they run up, Dad's home, you know, they kind of mug me, jump on me, you know, give me a bunch of love, which, you know, bothers Jill because Jill has to deal with them for most of the day. They love it when he walks in the door. And we do this thing at dinner and we'll do highs and lows. My high is when Daddy came home and I'm like, what about me? Seeing Mom come off the bus, it's never anybody's high. <laughs> How do you ask? May I please have what? A snack? All right, last one. I say that a lot. I just really enjoy coming home to all of them, and I want to hear about their day. Mm -mm. Why don't you get your stool and you can help me stir? Okay. There's Anna Claire. Daddy! 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 Hey there. Dada. Hey, Daddy. We met in study hall at LSU when we were both in college. She was working with the volleyball team. I was playing football. He lived across the hall from one of my friends on the volleyball team, and I kept coming over and kept saying, you know, all these girls are six foot three, and here's this little five foot nothing, and kept saying, who's that? We were friends first. We, we were friends for almost a year and then kind of gradually worked our way into dating. Got married in 2005, right before his senior season. So then got drafted here in 06. I've been here ever since. So we kind of grew up here in Western New York together. <laughs> Why don't you and Gray go play in the basement? You want to go play? No. What about that <laughs> hockey game you weren't playing yesterday? No. Friday is Star Wars Day. At school? Yeah. I think you should be Darth Vader. Is that a pig? pig? What does the pig say? Right. Reed, what are you doing, buddy? <laughs> Let me see it. Let me see it. Thank you. You know, we waited three days. It was the first pick of the fifth round. And so Friday night, we knew we probably wouldn't get drafted, but we, you know, may, maybe thought he'd go like third, maybe fourth round. Sure enough, he gets a call from Marv Levy when I'm in the shower. <laughs> I think she'd given up. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why. It was the first overall pick of the fifth round, but you know, she, she, was, uh, she was in the bathroom, she missed it. And so I missed his name going across, I missed them saying like, pick from LSU, I've mean, actually never seen it live, like him, you know, getting picked. I just remember walking out and he's on his phone in his parents' backyard and I'm like, where are we going, where, where are we gonna live? And they're like, Buffalo, I'm like, Buffalo, wow, <laughs> where is that? <laughs> Eating spaghetti around here is kind of a full contact sport, so steer clear. The main culprit's not here. He's in there jumping off furniture. Gray, come here, buddy. Come on. Hey, dinner's ready, everybody. I can't say it. Say it. Try it again. God, our Father. God, our Father. Oh, wait, it's Anna Claire's turn. Keep listening. Hi, is that Daddy came home? Mm-hmm. My high is dinner with everybody, of course. And my low, I got up super early this morning and I'm gonna get up super early tomorrow. And it was really cold. Did you tell about your library book? Huh? <laughs> he doesn't know. It was so funny because we had taken uh, Reed and Kate and Anna Claire downtown to pass out Thanksgiving dinners. The same day as the Thanksgiving Blitz. So Kyle takes them out of school, brings them back to school after the Blitz is over. You know what? I, I feel good about my parenting today. And then that afternoon, my kids come stomping off the bus. Coming off the bus and he's hanging his head and his sisters are just, just on him. Like, what's the problem? And Anna Claire, our, our second child, she's like, show him, Reed. And so sure enough, he pulls out this book and he's got this like, like look on his face like, oh, I didn't know what it was. I said, Reed, that's a Tom Brady book. And he goes, 
yeah, I thought it was just a football book. But, you know, and then his sisters were like, that's Tom Brady, that's the Patriots. So I'm like, Kyle, and he walks in the door, I'm like, Reed, go show daddy your book. You know, you can't win them all. All right, everybody, let's show them how we get to work. I know you don't like the big stuff, but hand it to mom. We try to live humbly and let them know that we're blessed with what I do. I'm able to play football, I'm able to play a game for a living, and we just want them to know that what you saw dad do required hours and hours of countless work, of blood, sweat, and tears that he put into it that you're going to have to put into what you want to do. We'll fight for every square inch of that turf out there. This is Buffalo! You know, he works as hard as he can, and that's what he's been doing for so long. Is That's his goal. He wants his team to succeed. He wants his town to feel it. And I, and I know he does, too. I mean, it's not just an individual thing. You know, he wants to bring it back to the glory days, you know, and I don't think he wants to quit until he sees it turn the corner. All right, Gray, we're ready. Here we go. Go ahead. I told him to be a fisherman. <laughs> we could not have been in a better place to start our family. Daddy, will you read us goodnight football? Yeah. It didn't take us 11 years to figure that out, but 11 years in, looking back on it and looking across the league, having been everywhere else to play and knowing guys everywhere, that this was the place that we were meant to be, and we're very blessed with that. One third and one, the ball is snapped, but the defense breaks through and the quarterback sacked. You know, people will say, oh, if you were in a bigger mark or this and that, and he's like, no, this is perfect. This is perfect for us. This is perfect for me and for, you know, my family, and I think it's true. I mean, it's just this sweet little spot here in Western New York. We absolutely love it. Good night, Helmet, and my favorite teams. Good night, football. Good night, and sweet dreams. The end.